Hey everyone, Ben Smith here, percussion product specialist for Evans Drumheads. I'm here at NAMM 2015 with MikeDolbear.com and I'd like to talk to you about some of the new products that we've got here. Starting off with 16 inch bass drum heads. We've seen 16s are becoming more and more popular. We've got a small bass drum but a huge sound when you've got it combined with our new 16 inch EMAD. So we've got the world's most popular bass drum head right here, the EMAD system, available for 16 inch bass drums. Now get this, not just for bass hoop bass drums but also the tom hoop bass drums. So if you've got a floor tom that you've converted into a bass drum, you've used one of those conversion kits to be able to flip it on its side and put a pedal to it. We've got the two different varieties because you need a different hoop depending on whether you've got the bass hoop style or the tom hoop, like a flange style hoop. So we've got those available, not just EMAD, but also the EQ4 and the G1 coated. That's our batter heads. Now on the Rezo side, we've also got our EQ3 smooth white and smooth black without port. So right here I've actually got the smooth white on there and that's got the same overtone control ring that you used to out of the EQ series. Creates a really nice smooth round sound and I tell you what, out of a 16 inch drum you're getting the most bass you could possibly imagine. So I'm going to do a little demo here, we'll see how much we can actually communicate across this mic. We got the 16 inch bass drum with an EMAD clear here. It's a lot of bass right there. It's tough to hear, but if you get to try one out in person right now, you'll be amazed. It, that 16 sounds a heck of a lot more like an 18 inch or possibly even a 20. And part of that is the EMAD system in combination with the level 360 collar, making it easier to tune a whole heck of a lot lower, being able to get that down to just above a wrinkle and a ton of punch out of that. Thanks so much for joining me. Once again, this is Ben Smith with Evans Drumheads. Thanks, everyone. Hey, everyone, it's Ben Smith here. Percussion product specialist for Evans Drumheads. We're here at NAM 2015. I'm with MikeDolbear.com, and I'm happy to tell you about a brand new Rezo head that we've got coming out here. It's actually available now, and it's called Rezo 7. This is a new coated 7 mil resonant head, and so it's thinner than your average resonant head, which is typically a 10 mil head. And it's actually a very unique, softer film designed to be able to provide you with a much rounder sound but a shorter sustain. Now, I've seen plenty of drummers out there, and I've done it myself, where you've got all sorts of muffling devices all over the batter head, shortening up sustain, especially in the studio. You find yourself close miking the drums, and you're trying to control the amount of resonance that you're getting out of them to get a really nice, articulate, punchy sound out of them without a bunch of bleed across all the drums. So what we've done is, rather than taking gaff tape or any other type of modification, device and applying it to the top head, we're attacking resonance with the resonant head. So being a thinner piece of film, it's actually going to resonate for a shorter period of time, but it actually has a much deeper resonant sound. So you're getting the deep resin bass fundamental response that you get out of the 10 mil head or even a 12 mil head, but at the same time a much shorter sustain that's more articulate and has a nice balance with the amount of resonance across the entire drum. So available now, the new Rezo 7 coated 7 mil resonant heads from Evans Drumheads. Thanks so much. Hello, how are you? This is Elijah Navarro, Promark Product Specialist uh, at D'Addario & Company. So today at this year's NAMM show, we're talking about the interactive drumstick display. We're discussing uh, the benefits of Select Balance, this new line of drumsticks, and the value in forward and rebound balance models. So of course, we wanted to create a line of drumsticks that was offered in five of the most popular drumstick diameters, from a 535 all the way up to a 595, or a 7A to a 5B. So in doing that, um, drummers will identify what their favorite or actual diameter is, and then they decide if they like it in either a forward or a rebound. Forward balance models are designed to optimize power and speed, while rebound balance models are designed to optimize finesse and agility. So depending on the type of gig you're playing, each stick could lend itself um, to help you uh, get a better performance out of that gig. Now, this is the interactive stick display that's a retail component that we're introducing this year for the very first time. Built in is an onboard Evans Real Feel Pad, a six inch. Uh, Retailers can merchandise up to 10 models of the Select Balance stick line. We have a, a forward 5B up top and a rebound 5B so the drummer can feel the fundamental differences. It's very clearly noted what exactly is happening here. This, this uh, display mounts to a standard double braced snare drum stand 
allowing for a silent salesman inside the store to, to allow drummers to interface and experience select balance. Uh, we're trusting that this is going to do very well for us. Moving over to the wall here. Here at the show, once a drummer uh, decides and discovers what his or her favorite diameter is, we'll go ahead and give one of these cool old Promark nubs to reinforce and remind what your favorite type was. So when you're ready to buy, you go ahead and take that into the store. So separate from Select Balance and the interactive drumstick display, we're talking about the Anton Fig model, signature stick, Bob Gatson, and Will Kennedy. All new signature sticks, Anton Fig is a long 16 and 3 8 stick. It's got a really fat or short taper, big round barrel or big round tip. Uh, it also features our Pro Grip solution for added grip on the handle. All right. Next, very quickly, is the Bob Gatson stick. This is a unique stick. It's a 585. Features a very long extended taper with an extended barrel tip on it. This taper is unique because it actually comes to a flat plane here which lends itself to a very quick rebound. You'll also notice, you'll also notice there's a, a groove here cut in the center. That equally balances the stick on this center point, so the front is equally balanced to the rear or the handle. Lastly, we have the Will Kennedy signature stick. Uh, similar to the Select Balance line of drumsticks, this is a rebound 580 or 55A with an added half inch in overall length. This is important for the drummers that are looking for a little more real estate and sit a little further back, maybe taller drummers as well. That 16 and a half inch uh, definitely does the trick for them. So these three, in combination with the select balance line of drumsticks, uh, of course the, the interactive drumstick display itself is what we're featuring at this year's NAM. Keep in mind, with the select balance display, this is perfect for international markets as all the graphics are interchangeable, easily translatable, and of course the information can be easily changed out as the line expands and we add new models. We can expect Acorn models this year.